Hey guys, I thought I'd bring you along on my walk today. It's a lovely day here in La Rochelle in France. I'm here for the rest of the month, enjoying myself, drinking wine and eating too much cheese. But anyway, the nature of this video is about dealing with failure. As a poker player, you need to be able to deal with failure in the right way. There's gonna be so many setbacks in your poker career. You're gonna have so many downswings, so many losing days, so many losing sessions that how you deal with failure is gonna dictate your volume. It's gonna dictate how you play. It's gonna dictate how much money you make over the course of your poker career. One of the biggest differences between the high achievers in poker, the guys who crush it, and the guys who just get by or just make a little bit, is their mindset and how they deal with downswings, how they deal with failure. So the first thing you gotta do is go, okay, Except as a poker player, there's gonna be a lot of obstacles. You're gonna get beaten up a lot. You're gonna have losing days, losing sessions. You need to get realistic with that from the get-go. You need to understand that it's not gonna be smooth sailing. Yep, some guys might get lucky and have a, a smoother ride than most, but for the average player, it's gonna be ups and downs. It's gonna be a brutal journey up and down. So you need to get used to the thinking about it that way. Go, okay, failure's gonna happen. Then you need to be like, okay, I need to get realistic with it. Every time I have a setback, I need to find a way to push past that, push through that. Failure or losing or any sort of setback is just a chance to learn. It's practice, it's always practice. So as a poker player, say you're moving to buy-ins and you lose, you get beaten up, it's practice. It's practice for dealing with that situation and you need practice. Sometimes we're gonna fail, sometimes we're gonna fall flat on our face and if you're not willing to accept that, you're not willing to deal with that, that uncomfortable situation when you've, you feel like you've lost, you feel like you're not doing good enough, you've gotta, it's almost embrace that pain, embrace that feeling of being uncomfortable and use that as fuel to learn from. So as a poker player, to have success, you need to be obsessed with learning. Forget the results in the short term, forget about whether you're winning or losing and are you learning at a quick rate? Because there's so much of poker, you can't just absorb all the information from a strategy side or watching a YouTube video, you've got to direct your learning to always improving and always getting better. If you're not, you're not gonna get the results that you should do in your poker career. So I find it super fascinating. I'm working with dozens of poker players and the way they deal with failure often dictates how much success they have. Some players have a losing day, losing session, losing week, and they'll go and study harder, get back to it straight away. Other players will crumble and they'll start having self-doubt and they'll be like, oh my God, I can't push through this. What do I do? I'm losing, like I don't know how to deal with this. And it's that relationship with failure is gonna dictate your whole poker career. It's gonna be a consistent thing. You're not gonna be able to run away from it. Even if you get amazingly good and awesome win rate, you're still gonna have losing sessions, losing days. You're still gonna to have to deal with failure no matter what. So start to think about your poker careers. How can I learn quicker? How can I just keep moving forward? How can I push past failures and keep moving? How can I change my mindset so I don't think about failure as a judgment? When I have a losing day, I don't think I am a bad player. I just think, okay, things haven't went well today. How can I learn from that? So it's making that mindset switch from failure being like so black and white and this is who I am. I'm a failure today. I'm a good player today. And thinking about, okay, failure is practice. How can you use failure to drive you forward? Get comfortable with that feeling throughout. You're gonna have your whole poker career that sometimes things aren't gonna go your way. So start to toughen up, start to use that mindset of yours in a positive way. Start to think about how you can embrace failures to learn more, to grow more, and become a better player. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Plenty more poker videos coming from me very soon.